my channel um, in this very special episode I'll be showing you guys what $300 will get you in Ho Chi Minh City so I've been wanting to make this video for a really long time but never really conjure up the courage to show you guys my apartment because I'm a neat freak I wanted like my um, room to be organized the truth is it's never gonna be organized. It's organized one minute and the next minute like I have clothes on the floor. So I thought this is a really real apartment tour. Not clean, not organized, just me living for real in Ho Chi Minh City, Vietnam for $300 at a studio apartment in District 2. All right, let's get to it. Okay guys, so walking into my apartment, um, sorry for the loud construction noise. I can't do anything about it. I've been dying, okay. So when you first walk in, you have the kitchen area and in my opinion, this is a moderate size for like a single person because I used to live in a smaller studio and it was literally like this much space here to here. And now I get this whole kitchen and this big oven that my boyfriend got me. Okay, it's great. And I have a full size fridge. I used to have like a mini fridge and now like I feel like an adult because I can go actual, oh. <laughs> I can go actual grocery shopping. Look at this. I have a watermelon, Coca-Cola. I have pumpkin. I'm a real adult. So after the kitchen, you have the nice dining area where you can see my beautiful picture but basically um i usually get flowers from my boyfriend but um you know it's it's not valentine's day and we're kind of broke so you get no flowers okay moving on okay the next area is the beautiful living area which i do not spend any time at so it's pointless for me to have a couch but it's here and it's for my guests and yeah so um as you can see i have my lovely faux fur and i have my donut pillow which i absolutely love glaze pink sprinkles donuts if you don't know me so over here is what i call like my sort of like setting area i have my like to-do list sometimes here i have my piggy bank which i put into every month I have my bluetooth speaker and i have my bible which i do my reading on the floor here sometimes oh sorry <laughs> all right moving on to the study area so this part is honestly my favorite part of my apartment one because it looks out to the beautiful scenery of empty space and silence so i love this place because no one can see me when i'm working and next to it is this majestic queen size bed. so this is my apartment at a glance it looks small on camera but honestly it's pretty big in my opinion but we're gonna go into the bathroom don't worry be happy okay walking into the bathroom Ooh la la so we have this humongous window to let the air in when you're taking a poop see and you can kind of take a peek at the people over there hello xin chào hai kong hui ha yeah i'm really ocd like i like to do this Um, that is not dish soap by the way, it just says that I hang my towels and my pajamas and that's all you get for the bathroom. Okay guys, thank you so much for watching. A really short video but just a glimpse of what I live in, where my humble abode is, where my sanctuary is. And if you guys live in Ho Chi Minh City as well, um, this place is great. I love District 2. I used to live in District 7, which I still love. But District 2 is good if you're a foreigner and you're an expat and you need like an English-speaking community. District 2, most people speak English, so you're good here. Um, other than that, you know, this is the standard price that you'll pay for a living space of this size. Around 7 million to 8 million is usually the standard price for most foreigners living in a studio apartment. You can get cheaper, but for me, my utmost importance was cleanliness and no lizards. <laughs> I haven't seen a li Oh, there was a lizard one time under my bed. I screamed and left the house for 24 hours. 
other than that, this place has been great. And I'm gonna go because it's really hot. I need to turn on my fan. So there we go. Okay, guys. Thank you for watching. <laughs> Remember, you're right. I'm... You're right. <laughs>